Good morning, YouTube land. We're off on another adventure today. Come along with us. We'd love to have you. Got a flock of about 14 Canadian geese. When I was a little kid, we used to always go to Wisconsin for vacation because that's where my dad was from. Now this part of Colorado looks like Wisconsin. Just look at the color of that field. I love it. And then look at the mountains behind. So beautiful. And then look how pretty the lake looks from here. And here. And from here. Look at all the pelicans out there, all huddled together. There must be 50 of them out there. Let me see if I can get a close-up. Boy, that is a bunch of pelicans. I just set out my solar panel and one of the jackeries, and um, all of a sudden, the uh, sky turned gray. <laughs> It seems like a storm is blowing over. But we have a saying in Colorado. If you don't like the weather, just wait a minute. <laughs> we'll take a look around inside my van now that I've lived in it for almost three weeks. This thing here, my sister gave me. You soak it in water and then it's, it's um, something for the dogs to lay on when it's really hot. Here I have the three leashes all tucked away so I can easily grab one leash at a time. Here I have water for the dogs and the toy tucks in here to keep the water from sliding around. Cod is working really well and under here I have the futon. During the daytime I can slip my window coverings into the, in between the pieces of the futon. There's the trusty bedroll. And of course the powder room. So up on top of here, there's a crack on this side, passenger side, back door. And so I have another of these cushions and I just stuff it down in there so that the dogs don't fall off of the cot and fall down in there. Buddy's enjoying it. Precious is enjoying it. Baby Kiki is always enjoying things. So I have the second cushion now down here on top of these bins. The bins are for storage. And then this area here is where the dogs can um, sleep at night. When I'm up on the cot, then they can be down here. Underneath here, I've got more water. I've got an upside down bucket. I've got the uh, Instapot, which I haven't used very much yet, but I think I will. And the stroller that usually fits right in here is at my sister's house. It's come in really handy when we need to take the dogs inside. Like when it's really, really hot outside and we can't leave them in the car. So we just pop them in the stroller Take them with us. The cockpit area is working very well. Up on top here, I have towels, face masks, Kleenex. In the front window, I have chips. And right here in between, I have a small trash can with a spray bottle of water and a spray bottle of water and vinegar mixed. 
down inside this little green thing here is just my mini trash can for mini trash. Now on the passenger side in front, I have Jackery, which is right now running the uh, Dometic refrigerator. I have, I tied, uh, or hooked that to the seat, and it's running really well. I keep a sheet, a parka, and my extra flannel shirts here up on top of the fridge. And that is really helping to insulate it when it gets hot in here. Down underneath the Jackery is the Kodiak. I'm charging the Kodiak right now. This part's here. Hooked up to the solar panel on top. And I can get pretty much enough sunshine all day to run the refrigerator all night on the, with the Kodiak. And then during the day, I run the fridge with the Jackeries. Good night, everybody. That's it for today. Hope you enjoyed the pelicans and the beautiful water. See you next time. Remember, Jesus loves you. 2020 is the year of victory. See you next time. Mwah. Bye.